Nigga, stand on that family. You know what you want to live for and do. You know you want to wake up and fuck this nigga, fuck this nigga, fuck that nigga, and text this nigga, text that nigga, then do that and leave me alone, bro. Real talk, bro. Why she still standing there? On live, just go the fuck, walk the fuck off, bro. Something about We got a, a female and a male in an argument. I don't know what the argument about. We're going to see. But we finna go ahead and get into this. I ain't going to hold y'all no longer. You feel me? And then what you say? I'm going to give y'all honest advice of what I would have did and what I feel like y'all should do based off how I feel about the video. So let's get it. Let's get it. When I come back, I promise, I'm going to make it up to you. I'm gonna make it up to you. Wait, what? I'm gonna make it up to you. Okay, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Let's read these comments right quick. We gotta really get into detail. She's stupid as fuck times thousand, times a hundred, and he's stupid as well. Fuck, fuck even still fucking with her. They both toxic. Uh, that's what co copedency looks like. She enjoys this. I'm not even gonna speak, because I'll be in Facebook jail. <laughs> Hell no, let's get it. I'm gonna make it up to you. The nigga say, leave your pennies at home, fam. Wait, what? Cause my shit be tweaking, so we gotta make sure we still got that bitch. <clears throat> I'm gonna make it up to you. I'm gonna make it up to you. The nigga say, leave your pennies at home, fam. She told the nigga, okay. Now tell me what type of nigga I'm supposed to be. You know what I'm saying? What type of nigga I'm supposed to be? We steady going through this bullshit, fam. Tell this all I'm saying, fam. You gonna constantly be a hoe? Just leave me alone, bro. Cause my relationship shit, it come with a lot of stand down motherfucking rules, bro. So, like, I <laughs> you got rules for a relationship, bro. You don't need to be in a relationship. I can tell he don't know nothing about a relationship. He young as shit. Like, don't get me wrong. I'm young as shit, too, but I'm very mature in the mindset. Now, I ain't gonna lie for, I, I slapped a bitch before, I did a lot of shit in the past, but we got mistakes to be made, you feel me? And he's making a mistake, a big one, right now, now, not saying he making a mistake on a girl, because obviously the, the bitch is a hoe, you feel me? But you know that before you get the date, huh? You feel it, you get that feeling like the little shit she do in the beginning of the dates, you feel me? What she be wearing, how she be talking, you be like, damn, this bitch a hoe. And you know it, you be thinking it in your head, but you still fuck with her, so for you to still rock with her after you know... She possibly could be a hoe, and then you consistently seeing her do a hoe shit. Why is you still with her? Why you want to? You just want to beat on her, bro. You just want to get your anger out. You just want to. You just want to project, bro. You you using her as a fucking a fucking vessel to beat on. Like you using her as a fucking vessel to beat her ass, bro. And for her to stay, bro, she has no self awareness. Like you can get more. You can get a real nigga, bro. You can get a real nigga who love you. It's out her niggas. Niggas out here turning hoes into housewives nowadays, bro. Know your worth, bro. You feel me? If you gonna love me, love me, bro. Real talk. All that tie me down and don't want to see me with nobody, but you want to do what you at. Yeah, you gonna come and get your ass handled, bro. Real talk, bro. You want to be able to... Hell no, nah, bro. That's all. Yeah, bro, if you want to run around and do that, just leave me alone. What's so hard about that? She you get into it, you play like you want to leave me alone, you do that. And then what you say, I really want to be with you, right? Um, I say I want to be with you, too. Woozy. Why you laughing shit, bro? You wouldn't laugh to beat this bitch ass? Like, no, seriously. You you turned on the lie to beat this bitch ass, bro? On purpose, like, I'm finna beat this bitch ass. Let me put it on live. Like, you trying to get a... You make this bitch a lesson, bro? If anything, you look like a fucking goofy in the lane. Like, you hitting females and shit. Like, I told you, bro, like, that shit is lame activity, bro. Real cornball shit. Be a man and walk the fuck away, bro. Take your fucking L, bro. Take your lesson. Woo, 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 woo. Here we go. Back doing shit like this. If you gonna stand on that fam, stand on that and leave me alone, bro. Who cares? Cause I'm steady texting you. I love you ass shit. Who cares? Nigga, stand on that fam. You know what you wanna live for. What is you talking about right now, bro? So you basically telling her to leave, but at the same time telling her. So you tell her how to leave you, but every time she try to leave you, you tell her the bitch you love her and don't leave. Bro, make it make sense. Do you want the bitch to leave you or not? It seems like you want the bitch, you just want to keep being on the bitch. So you want the bitch, and you know she a hoe, 
But you beating on the bitch because you know, because she doing whole shit. But you telling the bitch to leave you, but telling her don't listen to what you say. Bitch, you confusing me. What the fuck? I'll continue to do the same shit too. Like, what the I fuck? Know, you know, you want to wake on, up bro. and fuck this nigga, fuck this nigga, fuck that nigga. Minute, and text this nigga, text this nigga. I love you ass. I love you too, too. Woo, 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 woo. Here we go. Back doing shit like this. If you going to stand on that fam, stand on that and leave me alone, bro. Listen. Who cares because I'm steady texting you? I love you ass shit. Right, bro. Come on, make Who it make sense, bro. Nigga, stand on that family. You know what you want to live for and do. You know you want to wake up and fuck this nigga, fuck this nigga, fuck that nigga, and text this nigga, text that nigga, then do that and leave me alone, bro. Real talk, bro. Why she still standing there? On live, just go with the fuck, walk the fuck off, bro. Something about that is embarrassing right now. To the point, bro, I'm going to hurt you, bro. Like, real talk. Like, say I'm going to hurt you, bro. Real talk. I don't give a damn who rocking behind you. None of that. Real talk, bro. Real time, I mean, bro. I can tell it's coming from a place. It's not love. This ain't love, but he he thinks he love her right now. You feel me? So, cause when I love the bitch, bro, I was like crashing out, and I do shit like, damn, I'm finna smash this bitch windows out. Like, what the fuck? Why would you do that? Instead of me realizing, like, damn, I don't think this shit funny. This making me react in certain emotions. It's putting me in this angry emotion. Got me got me doing dumb shit and looking goofy as hell. Instead of me reflecting on the situation and reflecting on my emotions and trying to find the best positive solution besides negativity and being violent towards her and causing issues in my life, I reflected and not projected my emotions. I reflected off off conflict instead of being a man and sitting there and thinking like, damn, bro, this shit ain't funny. Let me move around. That's what he, he right now, he just reflecting off his, you know, off his emotions and shit. You feel me? Like, nigga, feelings, like, I'm steady He's tired. Stuck in an angry I'm steady tired you, bro. I'm not going to hit you no more. But then again, fam, you make a nigga do what he That's you basically just told her, yeah, bro, I'm a liar. I'm a consecutive liar, bro, so don't believe shit I said. You do, bro. If you know you been tasting this nigga and doing that shit, delete the shit, fam. You a fuck dumb What happened to the comments, bro? Fam. The, the fuck happened to the comments, bro? Ain't nobody commenting. You dumb. You a follower. You go. You're here for the you comments, bro. Let's be honest. You be a follower in Miami. Entertainment a little bit. Fam, the real nigga what the fuck too. did you graduate for, bro? You the ain't using shit. Why is you bringing up her past, bro? Self-projecting. So this shit you been feeling like, you been feeling like she a hoe and she dumb as fuck and she graduated for no reason. This shit you been wanting to say, but now you just using this little argument and shit to bring it up. The fuck you got this big ass head for? The fuck you take your hair down for? Now you just calling her ugly and shit. Now you just trying to make her feel bad and shit. Like, what is you doing, bro? Be a man, bro. She a hoe. You fell for a hoe, bro. You locked in with a hoe. She's a slut. She's an eater. What the fuck? Bro, it's not her fault, bro. That's her character until she elevate and get out of it, bro. And I'm not saying that she gonna forever be a hoe, no. No, but you can't turn a hoe to a housewife. To think, right? Because your head you was blood, into the shit, right? DNA. Huh? The fuck you sitting there crying, looking dumb and shit. Look at you. you walk away. That's she not even crying. If you tired of looking like that, then just leave me alone, bro. She not even ugly. That's the thing. Because every time, fam, you do the shit you do, I'm a constant have your ass looking like this. <laughs> Yeah, and I'm going to bring it right to Facebook because I'm tired of your ass you doing this. Lame. And we ain't even brought it to Facebook yet. The only reason I'm doing this shit now because every time she get mad at me, she go to posting, I'm single. Pull up on who? Yeah, she like that. So Them is the red flags, niggas. Listen, if you dating a girl and she like real social media, like now I don't date social media bitches. Like you got to be, my bad, my fault. My, my bad. I apologize. I don't date social media females because... Like, them, them be tail tags. Like, she's so social media. She Facebook live. She who said this, this, and that. Bro, I don't even live in that reality no more. That ain't me no more. I barely be on social media. I don't like seeing other people's lives because that affect my brain ment mentality. And I be thinking, like, damn, I wish I had that. But at the end of the day, but at the end of the day I need to respect what I got going on in the present. I need to realize, like, damn, this shit I got worth a lot, bro. Like, you don't even know what the fuck really going on behind them. Instagram accounts and Facebook accounts and shit, bro. But I don't date social media girls who be on Facebook just be doing shit, sharing shit. Oh, y'all just for sharing that shit. No, you shared it for a reason. When I share Facebook posts, oh, I felt that shit. Or that related to my life. I don't just I don't just be sharing shit. I mean, I do, but I read it too. <laughs> that's why I don't date social media girls, bro. That social media shit mess up the whole relationship. Like, if you talk to a girl, I advise you don't go to her social media, bro. Just really figure it out, bro. Just figure it out the girl out herself. 
Cause the social media will make you just not like the girl, bro. I'm just being honest. Now she's single. Pull up on who? Look at her dumb ass. Yeah, yeah. Whoa. You ain't got yeah. Get mad. I Ooh, get shit. mad. It stopped recording. Hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. The mic kind of fucked up a little bit. Damn, I just ate your pussy and everything. Come on, bro. We did not want to know that shit. I did not. Care. That shit jumping too. Look at your dumb ass. Hundred views. Come. Look at him. Wait a minute, bro. Make this shit make sense, bro. So you knew the bitch was doing this and you still ate a pussy after you knew she was getting fucked? Hey, you nasty. I told you this nigga ain't got no morals, bro. No morals. If I, I, I leave a bitch for cheating on me, bro, I can't date you. Cheating on me? All right, that's different. But getting fucked, bro? Somebody, somebody fucked that besides me? Oh, I'm leaving you, bro. I don't care how much I love you, bro. As soon as I find out you cheating, bro, I'm leaving your ass, bro. I might try to come back, but at the end of the day, I'm still gonna realize, like, damn, bro. Yeah, this bitch ain't for me. She got fucked. Like, once somebody else cracking it besides me, bro, you owe it. Um, bro, I'm not going back. The bye -bye. Lady. Sneaking and see while I'm sleeping here texting niggas and see. That shit crazy. It's not. You think a nigga in here sleep? Who I sneak your text? Fam, you went in the restroom time you had the shit. I was in the restroom, I wanna take And what I asked you when you come back. What I asked you when you came back. Bro, that message said today, nigga, he sent that last night you went in there and read it this morning. You think you sleep? Bitch, I been here bitch, I been here before. I know you have, and I ain't even looking at you. This ain't my first time on earth, bro. I'm Now this nigga didn't want to spare you, bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This nigga said, I've been here before. This is not my first time on earth. Get the fuck out of here. You cannot be spiritual and dumb at the same time. Hold on, let's make sure we still record. All right, we good, bro. Come on, bro. Nigga didn't win spiritual, bro. This shit is, this whole video is hilarious, bro. On your seat, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm nigga, on bro. him 10 steps ahead of you, fam. You water down. Like, whoever taught you the game, you need to get that shit back. Real talk. You need to get that shit back, bro, because the game they taught you is not for sure, fam. They gonna come to get you caught up. Look at you. The game they taught you, look at you. Shit, yeah. getting, shit getting you beat up and shit, fam. You just a bad Look at nigga. you. That's all I'm saying, say. If you want to keep doing what you doing. This is what I would have did. If I just found out my bitch a hoe multiple times. First of all, I ain't no multiple times. It's like twice with me. You cheat on me the first time, but you ain't get fucked. All right, we talk about the communication is key. Boom. You do it again and you got fucked, it's over with. But I'ma have that man, I'ma have that confidence, ain't man to man. But I'ma have that real nigga conversation with you, like, gee, like, what's going on? What did I do wrong? What could I, what, 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 what was it that I could have did better for you? Like, I'm not, I don't wanna deal with you no more, cause I feel like this, but I ain't go down, you ain't gonna call you home, just get, you need better for yourself. This is not what you, you feel me? I'ma really talk to her, bro. I'm not finna really just, I'm not, I'ma be mad as shit, but I'ma walk out. The walk out gonna happen before the conversation, bro. Cause, I don't want to get stuck in that angry emotion where I'm just saying shit to the bitch while I don't mean or just doing shit that I'm regret. Are you feeling me? I learned based off my prior relationships, bro. You You Because you know I love you, fam. Get but I'm telling fuck. you, bro. I ain't tripping my beating you up. I promise I'm not. I'm not. If that's what you want, you want to keep getting caught up. Damn, I got a crazy ass dick. This nigga going to beat my ass. I'm cool with that. That shit is not cool to say. Like, damn, I got a crazy nigga. This nigga gonna beat my ass. That shit is not cool to say. Like, even me saying it right now, like, damn, bro, I know I'm gonna have to beat this bitch ass if she cheat on me again. Like, bro, what, bro? That's what you want. That's that what you stand on. That's cool, what you. Bro. Stop. This shit is embarrassing, bro. This whole video is. I need. Th this whole video is ignorant. Let me just read these comments, though. He called her a dumb criminal. Stay in school, kids. <laughs> Hell no. <nah. laughs> Uh, break up with her then, no point in hitting someone who don't want to be with you, for sure. The fact that he said, I love you, and I'm not tripping about beating you up in the same sentence is insane. I'm telling you. He embarrassed himself. He got to face himself and has to live with what he did every day. The fact that this man went on live to beat this girl up and tell the world on live like he can't go to jail for his girl, live is insane. He never went to jail for this. This world is crazy. Dude is just as broken as she is. The fact that he's talking about how they consistently go through this tells you everything. It's sad. 
Knowing full damn well he's been cheating on her, on her since the day they met. I am so happy that I have completely surpassed the need for a relationship very much so. Surpassed. No. Y'all speaking facts, bro. I don't agree with the hint, but damn, he got a point. If you want to be free to mess around with multiple people, then just be single. That's a fact too, but at the same time, nigga, you leave, bro. You feel me? Women don't leave a relationship until... They leave the relationship... Well, you know when a woman has left the relationship without leaving a relationship. This is what women do when they want to leave your ass. They already left you mentally and emotionally. They just dare because they just waiting to move on. They just waiting for the next nigga to come and take your spot. And then that's when they start... If, if she really did love you, bro... She not going to want to tell you that she over with you. So she going to do little weird shit like high attitudes. She going to just start. She going to start acting different. When the girl that you met start acting different. Like shit different. The messages different. Slower messages. Phone calls. She ain't really tripping about calling you back. Or she don't really care if you call her back no more. She don't care what you doing. Where you at like that for real. She didn't damn near falling. She's falling out of love with you. She just waiting for the next nigga to take your spot. They don't lead a relationship. And today they found the next nigga. Or the nigga to be the next nigga. You feel me? And sometimes, I, bro. My last relationship, she left me, but I also left her. I knew she was cheating. And I knew something was off because I told you she was acting different. I tried to go through her phone. I did some dumb shit. Uh, busted her door. Just reacting off angry emotions, right? I still, today, to the, still to this day, I still don't know what the fuck was in that bitch phone. But I know she was cheating on me. Because that she did not want to give up that phone, bro, at all, bro. So whatever she was doing, it was some real crucial, heartbroken shit. But she didn't want to let me go through that phone because she didn't want to hurt me. Because she, she didn't love me no more, but she had love for me. You feel me? And that was the best thing that ever happened to me. For that relationship to be over with. That shit was toxic, bro. I was in a toxic mindset, bro, at the time. One thinking or none, bro. But, yeah, I forgot the whole point here. But you get the point, bro. Yeah, bro. I'm done with this video, bro. That shit was crazy wild, bro. If y'all want more videos like this, y'all just let me know. I got y'all, boy.